That story in Milford, Massachusetts, the 18 year old who was from Providence jumped from a ledge into that quarry in Milford yesterday, but he never surfaced. This morning, divers made the grim discovery. NBC 10's Mario Hilario is there now with details. Mario. Good afternoon, Frank. We're here on Walden Way in Milford. The quarry in question is down a path behind the woods behind me. Still a very active scene here with uh, police and fire personnel as the search ended just a couple of hours ago for that missing Rhode Island teenager. He has now been identified as 18-year-old Nentor Don of Providence. Now, police say Don and four others came to the Fletcher Quarry here in Milford to go swimming yesterday. According to those he was with, when he jumped from a ledge into the water, he landed, quote, awkwardly and then never resurfaced. Crews suspended their search yesterday evening, then resumed it first thing this morning. It was a state police dive team using sonar who found Don about 70 feet below the surface in an area that was searched yesterday, but not to that depth. The fire chief here in Milford talked about the challenges of the terrain. Um, the area is very rugged surrounding the quarry. Um, once you deal with the, the height, get down into the water, you have technical rescue teams operating, getting equipment up and down. Uh, we have to lower boats into the water. And it's just plain sad. You have an 18 year old kid that went to go swimming with friends, you know, and not realizing the dangers uh, of the quarry. Uh, you know, they, they lost their son. Now, both the police and fire chiefs emphasize they discourage people from coming to these quarries to swim because of the danger. The police chief said they are calling this an accidental death. Crews are still here working on recovering Don's body from below the water. An autopsy will be done. We're live in Milford, Massachusetts. Mario Clario, NBC 10 News.